Hello and welcome to another Black Talk Radio News Brief. My name is Scotty Reed, of course. Please visit blacktalkradionetwork.com and support the nonprofit media organization, Black Talk Media Project. On this particular news brief, I want to talk about this upcoming rally tonight here in Gaston County where uh, Black Talk Media Project is based. As you can see, there will be a protest tonight at 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time um, at the Gaston County Courthouse. Um, the young people who are part of the Gaston County Freedom Fighters organized this protest. This follows another protest they just had a couple of days ago. And I also know that there will be more protests concerning um, that Confederate statue. Now, let me speak to you as uh, a U.S. veteran. Even though I am not proud of my service, I went in the, went into the U.S. Army to get college money at 20 years old. And I wasn't really thinking about, you know, the implications of me serving in an army um, that has pretty much uh, spread racism and white supremacy and corporate uh, U.S. corporate dominance around the world and subjecting people to all kind of horrors of war. Um, but, you know, often I say I'm broadcasting from behind enemy lines, and this is one of the reasons why it feels like for black people, we are behind enemy lines. It doesn't feel like for many of us that we're in the land of the free and home of the brave, okay? Um, we're in a nation that still practices slavery via the 13th Amendment, and that is what this statute represents for many African Americans as well as uh, European Americans here in this county. We know that it stands for white supremacy. We know it stands for racism. We know it celebrates uh, people who went to war to fight slavery, okay? To keep slavery in place, I should say. All right, so, you know, um, there have been a number of petitions over the years and the Gaston County uh, Commission just won't listen to the people, just won't listen to the majority of the people, I should say. So I'll be going out there just to show my support. I, I don't plan on speaking uh, unless I'm called on or given the opportunity to speak, but I just want to go out there to support. Um, I probably will be a little late, got to pick up my grandson right at seven, but he's at my niece's house in uh, Gaston County. So we should, you know, be there uh, a little bit after 7 o'clock p.m. And I just want to ask other people uh, to come out. You know, Commissioner Chad Brown, um, actually uh, my cousin Jennifer Graham, had ran against him for that county seat. And a number of people that I had asked to come out to vote, not for her specifically, uh, but to vote for Bernie Sanders in, in the primary, you know, they didn't even show up. They ain't even show up to vote. Voting matters. It, more so locally than it matters federally. I believe in voting. I understand everybody don't believe in voting, but I definitely um, believe in taking responsibility in the communities in which we live. Um, yeah, protesting can bring policy changes. Demonstrations can bring policy changes. Rioting can bring policy changes. But if we really want long lasting change, we need a change in political leadership. So just keep that in mind, because we got this county commissioner named Chad Brown, uh, who's talking about, oh, that, that statue uh, can be used as a platform to educate people why we don't want slavery. We can bring children there and tell them both sides. You know, what both sides? Obviously, we know the uh, fraudulent arguments that a lot of these cons uh, Confederate sympathizers like to talk about states' rights, but the record is clear of why they succeeded from the United States, and that was to maintain slavery, all right? And I'm tired um, if I had to go to the courthouse, which I try to stay away from there, but, you know, that's where a lot of business is conducted. Uh, records are kept there. And I'm tired as a black person and as a United States veteran of going to the courthouse and then having to watch uh, or or see this monstrosity of a monument uh, to Confederate traitors of the United States of, of America. Let's just call them what they are. All right. 
And and so I will be out there just to uh, show my support what these young people in Gaston County are doing. And if you're not doing anything this evening, I would hope that you would show up too. Again, that'll be 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern time tonight at the Gaston County Courthouse. Peace and blessings to all.